Hi everyone, we're here at Big Boulder and joining me is Chris Barrett from the Pocono Mountains Visitors Bureau and co-host of the PTN Network. It's the ski season. It is, so we have a great ski season. So this is exciting for us because as you know, the Poconos is really known for uh, outdoor activities in winter. You know, one of the things is people say, oh, I don't know if I want to ski, but it's very easy to learn to ski. It really is, and all the ski resorts are very, very focused in that, on that beginner. And the one thing I've always noticed is a lot of folks who've been teaching people to ski have been with the resorts for decades. And they just do it out of passion and love for the sport. So they really have seen thousands of people who have trepidation to start, and they really know how to handle it. And they do a really great job with it. They make people feel confident and they step them so they don't really, they don't really push them past their limit. Mm -hmm. And it's just really kind of neat to see and that people end up loving the sport. And then somebody who says, oh, I'm a little rusty, they still have <laughs> intermediate teaching, private lessons as well. Right. I mean, the whole gamut, group, private, and, and they're really, really good people. Uh, they understand the sport. They understand all the new equipment, all the safety features of that equipment, because that's always changing. So uh, that's really helpful, too, as well. And each resort rents equipment if you don't have it or if you forget something. So when you get here, everything you need is right here. And we just happen to be a big boulder right now. So, and they're more within the Poconos. They all have great, great rentals. For people who like to snow tube, they have that here. <laughs> right, and that's my speed is snow tubing. So if you're really reticent, you have trepidation, or you want to do it, or, or you, a family. So I remember when my kids are really small, the first thing we do is take them snow tubing to kind of just acclimate to being outside in the winter. And then they really enjoyed it and they loved it. It's very easy, it's very low impact, it's incredibly safe. And it's just, it's a great way, I think, to really start before you step up. I know every season there's a reason to get out and do the sports. And the other thing is snowboarding. Right, which is really, you know, within the last five to 10 years has really become increasingly popular. And you see a lot of snowboarders on ski slopes. So there's a fair mix of both, I think, really, your people that ski and people who snowboard. I, I, a lot of our slopes are really known. So for some are a little bit more difficult than others, but that's how you can graduate and kind of get up from being a beginner to intermediate to expert. So when you're here in the Poconos for winter activities, there's so many things you can do. So you can make a weekend of it when you visit here and ski. And some of our resorts even have indoor water parks with controlled temperatures. So Camelback, for instance, on a Saturday, you could be skiing at 20, 25, 30 degrees. And then the next day on Saturday, actually be inside in an 84 degree controlled temperature indoor water park. Or on Sunday, you can visit one of our great small towns like Jim Thorpe, Stroudsburg, Milford, Homesdale, Holly. That's the great thing about the Poconos is they're really something to do for everyone in the small towns, especially in the winter, they're really charming. And there's a lot of events happening around those small towns too, because the folks who live there, they just love that small town feel and so do our guests. Well, if people want more information, what should we tell them? Well, right now, we are at Big Boulder, so they can visit jfbb.com for all that information or poconotelevision.com for 365 24-7 information all about the Pocono Mountains and the little gems we just talked about.